Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, ladies, gentlemen, and those who are neither. My name is Ramblin' Rusty Elm, and you are watching Ramblin' with Rusty, Starfield Edition. Last time on Ramblin' with Rusty, we did some more exploration of Mercury before heading back up to Mars and stopping in at the Deimos Star Yards, where we picked up a mission to collect 500 aluminum to deliver to the star yards that mission of course led us to do a little bit of a quick exploration looking for somewhere to collect that aluminum and we ended up here on the moon of Kurtz orbiting Alpha, um, the planet Jemison and the Alpha Centauri system and as you can see we have a little bit of a start of an outpost here we are actually going to be building out the outpost in this episode so that we can fulfill that contract and without further ado let's get into it so now in between uh, episodes here I did a little bit of investigation and I discovered that that resource extractor up there and that one over there extract resources at the rate of one unit every 30 seconds so that means it's going to take us about 250 seconds of running around on this planet for that to fill 500 units but that warehouse or that uh, storage cube won't hold 500 units and neither will this ship so we're gonna head back to Jemison, stop in at the lodge, and uh, upgrade our research stuff. Let's see. Uh, we want to go to the lodge. All right. So here we are back at the lodge. I probably cut it out earlier, so I'll just say it again. Um, we're here at the lodge to research some uh, outpost development skills. Because this is the easiest place I know of to find one of these research stations. So the research lab lets you discover new crafting recipes by completing research projects. Each project requires materials in order to make progress. The materials needed can range from minerals to organic substances to manufactured components. Okay, so we want to work on our outpost development. Manufacturing, we don't need decoration. Horticulture, Outpost Defense, Robots, let's see, Discover Additional Furniture and Decorations, no, Manufacturing, Discover How, Simple Fabricators, Small Warehouse Modules, Intersystem Cargo Links, so we need to discover this, which means I need two zero wire, three iron which I have and we'll also need some adaptive frames so I need to go buy a zero wire and an adaptive frame so it looks like we will be right back with that okay ladies and gentlemen we are back from our shopping trip had a bit of a run around town trying to get stuff done or find what I was looking for actually but we did eventually find it over at the outfitters and before we get back into this I'm gonna go in here and I'm going to deactivate the quest that I'm on or that it wants to highlight so that it'll stop showing that stupid blue dot everywhere okay let's get into it outpost development uh, we decided we wanted manufacturing, simple fabricators, small warehouses, intersystem cargo links, 
So we need to confirm that. And we'll confirm that. Firm. Research projects unlocked manufacturing two, which is what I need. Uh, medium storage modules. So I need outpost engineering rank one. Okay, and to get outpost engineering. Okay, so outpost engineering is here. That means I need six more skill points because I have one already. And while I'm here, I'm going to go ahead and assign that. But I don't think I'm going to put it in science. Even though that is kind of what we're uh, focused on. I think ballistics is where I'm going to go. Alrighty, I went ahead and assigned that skill point to ballistics, so we'll see what we got going on there. Oh, hey, there's some credits laying around. It's always good to have. So, we're not going to be getting anything done here, so we're going to head back to Kurtz. And build an outpost, maybe. But first, I'm going to look and make sure I got the resources did I need to do so? Alright, ladies and gentlemen, here we are back at our outpost on the moon of Kurtz. Um, did some cleanup, got some things figured out, and we were coming back here to build. Let's see, we're going to need to build more of those. So, F, R, um, yes, oh, let's see, we have plenty of stuff to build with, so, E, and it says, oh, I'm missing some, I need to go find some more iron, apparently. Okay, so in the meantime, we are going to grab this aluminum, and we're going to stick it over in this one. Cute resources. In fact, we're going to stick all of these in here. And we're going to take a look at our inventory at the ship and see if there's anything we can pull out of here to stick in there. Because we have some seriously limited cargo space in this ship. Shields up! Let's dance! Oh! Okay, there's one of the ships we needed to destroy. So, let's see what we got going on here. Deimos Armored Transport. Engine and grab drive look like they're down. Okay. 
Oh, they're not letting us uh, contact them though. Looks like this is going to be a situation where we get to have to board them. Alright. Boarding it is. Okay, so this is going to be a pain. Well, I guess we, uh... This is just ridiculous. Somebody is definitely messing with shit. Make sure that sucker's dead. Jeez. This weapon is not doing me much good in here. I'm going to find whoever's playing with the gravity and kill him. Because that's just... Of 
course, I gotta say that uh, Bethesda's idea of zero G is a little wonky. Then again, maybe not, because it seems like the uh, they got shit just being thrown around rather than just starting to float. was close. Okay, let's see what we got going on in here. Back here with my loot. Well, at least the big shit isn't flo starting to float around. Uh, an unusable door.
Nothing. Nothing. Whoa. Something's out there. Something's right behind you, lady. Interesting little aside. Uh, let's go ahead and drop our loot in the cargo. ship and we're gonna head on down to the planet well once we can uh, target it actually I think it was a moon of Grissom station there I think we'll just drop down here and run around and look for some iron so that means we're gonna need this wow look at that iron oh somebody coming in for a landing right next to us yeah we got us a regular party going on over here ladies and gentlemen while I was on my way to this ship, another one landed just a little further away. So, let's see. Oh, this is a Vanguard ship. So, yeah, we're not even going to bother with this guy. I don't want to murder him, so we'll just let him be. Oh, a couple more colonists. Okay, so this we're at the second ship now. And we got a couple of yes, colonists back. here. Looking around like they're wondering if they should plant a garden. This ship looks really familiar, you know? So I'm gonna go in here and take a look at the name. Uh, the dagger. Locked. And we'll go over here. This should be the captain. Oh yes. Let's see what they're oh, doing. Man. Are we glad to find you? Our ship's in bad shape. We managed to land, but we're in need of repairs. You wouldn't have to have any spare ship parts, would you? We can probably jerry rig a fix on our own. Uh, you know, I do have some parts. I just have to go get them. So I will yeah, go get if you those. Spot any, we could really use it. Uh, there he is. Yes. Any luck? We could really use some help. Yeah. I, I'm, yeah, I'm just, I'm gonna ask for the money. Uh, this is gonna hurt, but you can't spend credits if you're dead. Here. Thank you very much. Uh, yeah. I hate to be kind of an ass about it, but if you're gonna fly in space, you should probably be equipped to do so. 
Besides, the game makes me pay for my shit parts, so... Alright, so on the way back to the ship from uh, giving those people their spare parts, instead of stopping here and investigate this structure, turns out it's a civilian outpost, and we'll see what we can find in here. Well, that looked more like what I'd expect of a uh, clandestine operations base. So this guy's still here. Interesting. I guess we'll see if he has anything to say for himself. Let's see. Let's talk to him. Oh God! You scared the shit out of me. Was it? Damn, Locke is busted too? Oh God, what else could go wrong? I'm on edge after the ship nearly blew up. Complete system failure after the last grab jump. I was barely able to land her in one piece. Anyway, I'll be here for a while. If you want to hang out, you can, but I won't be much company. Okay, well, I guess she doesn't want any help from me. Uh, let's see. Where is... Oh, there it is. Nothing in there. Okay, that was just weird. Escape. Um, so that's four. And I think we need number five there. So we have this all set up. We're going to continue collecting uh, resources. We're gonna head back here to the uh, ship, drop over to Jemison, sell this XSAT-3. It's not worth much, but I do need to pick up some more med packs anyways. But for now, I think we're going to leave this episode here. And when we come back, we will be going to uh, explore the area around our outpost. While we wait for the aluminum to fill up. I'm Ramblin' Rusty Helm. Remember to stop and smell the roses. Have a good night.